Hey guys, I'm back with another video. For today's video, I am going to compare two of my um, doughs. Homemade. <coughs> and regular Play-Doh. First things first, we are going to try and see if it can um, roll out well. So let's start with and we are going to see also which one is better. Um, every one that I do, I am going to do like I am going to put like a point because that one is better. So I'm going to just write dough comparison. Comparisons. And then put it in half. So I'm going to put homemade and regular slash normal. Okay, so First things first is going to be, can it roll? So, we, we are going to try the rolling. First, let's do... Rolling with Play-Doh. But first, let's talk, talk about the consistency of it. So with this, with the Play-Doh, it feels nice and soft and, e and it feels like it's easy to work with. You can mold it easily without getting it on your hands. But if you're using homemade, so, this, this is homemade dough. So, if you roll it, okay, it's, it's okay. It's holding its shape really well. But, you can't stretch out the homemade dough like this. Like how you would with Play-Doh. Because if you break it like this with the this dough, it'll just... Uh, well, I guess you can, you can do it, but you gotta be very, very slow. So, um, as much as you play with this dough... Like, it seems like it'll hold its shape really nicely. But, this bad part about this is that it gets on your hands. Which means you will have to use a wipe to play with your, if you're going to play with your homemade dough. And then after you're done with it. Just clean your hands with a nice wipe. So, yeah. I'm gonna get this off. So, next thing is that can you roll the doughs? 
So, of course, you're going to be able to roll out Play-Doh. See? Watch. You can roll it out easily. So with the consistency of the Play-Doh and the Softy Dough, I think that Play-Doh won. But let's see what the rolling part looks like. So here I rolled out this Play-Doh and it rolled out nicely. But now we're gonna see how it does with homemade Play-Doh. It's soft. The texture is like really, really soft. But when you roll it and you pick it up, it breaks. So I think Play-Doh wins with the rolling. Okay, next we are going to try to mold things with the Play-Doh. So, we're going to just roll it. Now we're going to roll this dough, and we're going to see if it'll mold. I'm molding a heart. So I'm going to roll, take off the excess from the Play-Doh and from the homemade Play-Doh. So it seems like with both hearts, this one shrunk down, but this one held its shape. So, but although both of these actually molded pretty good, so what I'm going to do is put points for both of them. One for homemade and one regular. Now let's try, like, we already tried, like, these type of cookie cutter molds. But let's see if it can take the molds we use for this. I am going to use a tomato mold. the play-doh through here press take it out oh okay so this one worked um it 
does have a tendency of sticking on everything. And if you take it off, it's not, it doesn't keep its shape. But if you're doing very sticky. So, if you're doing Play-Doh, With Play-Doh, you have to wash your hands constantly, but with the homemade dough, you're going to have to wash your hands constantly. But with um, Play-Doh, it keeps its shape and you don't have to wash your hands. So this score goes up to Play-Doh. So now we're going to see how the last thing we're going to figure out is can uh, homemade dough cut. So this is me cutting the Play-Doh and cutting this. They both work well. This one cuts smooth, and this one cuts perfect too. So it's pretty good. Can I have the knees? Honey, what's the matter, baby? Did you call? Yeah. Wait, what is it, honey? You forget why you called me? Did you call? Oh, 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 it's right on! Okay. So, now that we know that both does have different ways of getting you. Oh, sorry, baby love. Let me have this. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Of getting used, okay. Play-Doh is still winning. Uh, I have to get your thing ready now. Okay, guys, that's all for today. Um, the result was that Play-Doh, the regular normal Play-Doh, is better than homemade. Alright guys, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!